right? Yeah. 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 in four days. I can't <laughs> believe how old I am. 30 fucking three. Yeah. It is tough being a grown-up. Last week alone, I'll probably spend three and a half thousand hours updating my Facebook page, choosing which filter to put my Instagram for my 97 followers, and doing BuzzFeed quizzes. Today alone, I have found out which friend's character I am based on my choice of takeaway. <laughs> It's Rachel, obviously. Uh, my relationship status, based on my favourite cup of soup. Single. I know, I know. My, uh, my favourite sex position, based on my choice of condiment. You want to know, don't you? To pick a lily. The, the trouble with the internet, though, <laughs> the trouble with the internet though, it's like a black hole and once you get sucked in, you can't escape. And that's because of something called clickbait. You know those tantalising snippets of headlines that just reel you in like, um, you won't believe what Prince Charles was riding this weekend. <laughs> or, um, lose a stone in a week by eating a doner kebab. Or my favourite, the ones that really pull on your heartstrings like, this man baked his puppy a cake. What happened next would break your heart. Oh, I hate that. And I tell you who the biggest culprit of clickbait. It is one of the world's number one news websites, the Mail Online. That's it. You heard it. Yeah, that's it. Yeah. Mail Online. Now they had. Uh, I'm going to read verbatim. This was a headline in the last month. Lead story on one of the biggest websites, news websites in the world. Do Donald Trump's secret service have fake hands? I mean, that's intriguing, isn't it? So obviously, I clicked. 12 photos, two videos, entire article. Lead story, remember, lead story. The agent's arms seem to stay permanently fixed in the same awkward position for the entire procession. A long time for a person to hold his arms in such a way. I mean, they've got to be fake, haven't they? What we need, what we need is an expert for them to quote. It's okay though, they have. One blogger, one blogger suggested that the agent probably had his hands on a machine gun. <laughs> Remember, lead story, 12 photos, two videos. Final photo. <clears throat> this photo shows the agent's hands in a different position, showing that they were real after all. <laughs> for uh, wasting all our time then. It was different in the olden days, wasn't it? You know, the days of dial up and that familiar sound of <laughs> Really back then, the only thing that you'd do online was to ask Jeeves what websites to look at. <laughs> the most important thing you had to do was absolutely nail your email address. Now, who can remember what their email address was when they were about 14 years old? Yes. Yeah, shout them out. Anna Cowgirl at Hotmail. Anna what? Cowgirl, yeah. <laughs> oh, I didn't hear the first bit, but her fritter. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'll tell you what mine was. That's all you needed. <laughs> I've been fritted. Uh, I'll tell you what mine was. I based mine on um, arguably the best pop song ever written. S Club Party. Yes! <laughs> amen, amen to that. S Club Massive. Which contains the line, Then we got Joe, she got the flow. Get ready everybody, cause here we go! S Club! Yeah, you know it, you know it. Yeah. There ain't nobody like an S Club Party. So, my, e my email address was, you ready? Joe underscore with underscore her underscore 
Hello at hotmail.com. Pretty cool, eh? Pretty cool. I was literally like the email equivalent of Joe from S Club 7. I was lording that email around, getting them to write it down in their file of faxes. I was really cool. Yeah, I think you've still got yours, haven't you? Um, all was fine until one day. My mother asks me, Joanna, what's your email address? And I'm probably um, feeding my Tamagotchi or something. I'm like, yeah, mum, it's uh, Joe with a flow at hotmail.com. Silence. <laughs> Joanna, why does that make it sound like you've got your period? <laughs> <laughs> my street cred. That was it. I may as well have been Joey's on the blob at hotmail.com. <laughs> well, I tell you what, based on the same premise, had my name been Hannah, I'd have been Hannah screaming out for more at <laughs> yahoo.co.uk. <laughs> <laughs> it, it was about this time that I championed the following face in every single photo of me, which was this. <laughs> <laughs> no matter where I was, who I was with, my face would be... <laughs> And the thing is because you don't get to have that chance of the instant look back, not like we do nowadays, yeah? You're with me, yeah. Technology. Um, I'm pretty sure there's only three faces people do. I think someone sent out a memo to everyone under the age of 25. Maybe a millennial leader, Kim Kardashian, Snapchatted out the Ten Commandments of the selfie. From this day forward, thou shalt only do the following three phases. Well, lucky for you, I've got a copy of that memo and I can tell you what they are. <laughs> be boring if I didn't, wouldn't it? <laughs> so number one, we know we all know this one, and boys on the front row, just prepare yourself because it's the sexy one. Oh. Oh, oh. It's the familiar. We're all aware of it. It's yeah. the duck face. Oh. Oh. Yeah, the, ne the next one is a little trickier. <clears throat> I call this one. I'm sorry, I've just had a large object shoved up my. <sighs> <laughs> And the, and the final one, now this is for the pros, okay, because this is a full body movement. So what you do, you have to twist your whole body this way, and then twist your top body this way, and you put your hand on your hip, you bend your head at a really funny angle, and you're the ultimate twerk! <laughs> so, um, so in honor of my birthday, I thought we'd take a, um, a selfie, you can all do your favourite um, your favourite selfie pic. So gather in. If you can't see yourself, you're not in it. That's it. Selfie spray, smile, oh God. There we go, lovely. Um, and if you want a copy of that, then you can just email me on my grown up email address. It's uh, Joanna is completely comfortable with her menstrual cycle. <laughs> <laughs>